day for the ongoing vigil at the governor's mansion. We will meet at 4.30 p.m. in New Millennium Church, where the Reverend Wendell Griffin is the pastor, will join in the vigil today. Tomorrow, April 15th at 11.30 p.m. at Shoemaker Center in Bentonville, there will be a panel discussion entitled, What If We Could Save the Lives of Men? That's going to be in Bentonville, Arkansas tomorrow at 11.30. I'm going to be one of the panelists. Um, in addition to today's visual, there will be a visual at the governor's mansion on the night of each execution. If we have executions, we're going to be out there every single night. The executions are the executions are scheduled for 7 p.m. and 8.15 each night, and the Arkansas Coalition to Abolish the Death Penalty will be there beginning at 6 p.m. Supporters are encouraged to come at 6 p.m. or attend after attending their respective prayer services. It is vital to have a public presence during each execution, and if you're only able to make it one or two nights, please come at the end. You know, this is a lot of, this is a lot. This is a lot. In addition to the, the vigil that will be here in Little Rock, the ACADP vigil, there will also be individuals meeting in Rogers, Arkansas at 7 p.m. at St. Andrew's Episcopal Church in Rogers. It's 840 West Oak Street. And there will also be a vigil outside the prison at Commons Unit. Um, for each execution. So now we are going to, I'm sorry, there are books. Um, Damien Eccles did donate some books, and um, as with all of our donations, th um, those books are totally free. If you would like to make a, Dr. Whitfield is holding the books. We have books, and so if you, um, these books are free, if you would like to make a donation to the coalition, we would appreciate it. Um, if it was 50 cents or $5 or $5,000. Whatever you can afford to donate, please do that. And um, to the press, any press that would like to accompany the envoy up to the governor's mansion, please meet here at the petitions after the rally. Thank you guys again so much. We wouldn't be able to do this work without you.